Hello and welcome to this teacher guide on how to use the backdrop feature within Photobooth. Now Photobooth can be found in the dock of any Mac or MacBook. It comes as standard with the machine. Now I'm going to open it up and you'll see me on the webcam. There you go. Now uh, if I click on to effects you will find all sorts of weird and wonderful effects that you can use, some more educationally relevant than others. Uh, for example on this second window here we've got things like sepia and black and white uh, which could be used in history lessons. I'm going to scroll on to the fourth window here. Here we have a load of backdrops that already exist on the app itself, things like hologram in space and uh, the Eiffel Tower there. So some of those might be useful in geography or language lessons. Um, but I'm going to scroll all the way to the end window where you can add your own user backdrops. Now, as you can see, there are a number of user backdrops that I've already used. If you want to uh, create another one, all you do is you find yourself a picture, perhaps off the internet, and you drag and drop that into whichever user backdrop you like. Once you've done that, you select it, and it will prompt you to get out of frame. And I can slowly reveal myself to be part of that overall image. Now I've got a green background behind me, which is ideal, but actually just a just a normal blank wall would be uh, would work absolutely fine as well. So as you can see, I'm in front of that uh, particular volcano. I could then choose to change to the video function and record perhaps an educational video on volcano facts. So it's a really useful tool and as you can see it's, it's very effective.